Hi everyone and welcome to um, the 3D collaboration um, catch up for me. Um, as you know I am in a year long collaboration which is hosted by myself and Leslie Bromfield and it's almost coming to an end in May. We've got one last project in May and then that is the finish but I did miss out April as I said in my last video when I showed you the Christmas telephone box. So uh, we're sticking with Seasons because Seasons was the theme for April and this time I decided to go for a season that we're all very familiar of right now. <laughs> it's that uh, spring summer weather that we don't really know what's going on, whether it's hot or rainy. I think this is the most interesting of all seasons and I think there's one iconic thing that lets us know that it is this season and that is ice cream truck <laughs> did anyone else's parents used to tell them when the music played they were out of ice cream or was that just my family i need i need answers okay <laughs> traumatic anyway i absolutely love seeing the sight of an ice cream van now <clears throat> i didn't know this until i was actually driving around my town apparently crew is um the ice cream van town i didn't even know this I don't know if it's true or we're just making bold statements but I was I was I was surprised I mean we do have an ice cream van factory and repair centre so maybe we are um but anyway I decided to go with ice cream truck Um, how fun is this now I made it using um Christian's Crafty Adventures um food truck tutorial so I will link that in the description box along with the other ladies that are in the collaboration and um i've actually decorated it quite simple for me <laughs> um i went and used some holographic vinyl um this is sticky back vinyl um for the windows in this kind of blue color um the box itself is pink and what's fabulous is you only need to use one 12 by 12 sheet to make this so i think that's lovely very you can mass produce these <laughs> Um, to decorate, I've just used this really funky, I don't know, kind of retro 90s um, pattern here on the top and then just a strip around the edge. And then I use this like powder blue, which I think is quite the iconic uh, ice cream look. And then I've just added this huge ice cream uh, die cut here, which the sprinkles are actually stuck on. These are plastic sprinkles. I got from AliExpress but I've heard that you can actually use real sprinkles that you would like put on cakes in your projects because they don't go bad until like many many years <laughs> so your sprinkles will probably go won't go bad like your project will probably fall apart by the time they go bad if that makes sense so I may try that in the future but to stick them on I just flood it with glossy accent uh, and they all stick nice and solid and then I put a little bit of glossy accent on my cherry and everything and then here I've just um cut well, so these are stamps from my doodlebug set my doodlebug inspired set um party one and I just colored them in and stuck them in so it's sort of like this is like the menu <laughs> ice lollies and ice cream <laughs> Uh, and then the wheels is just some uh, black foam on black card and then I just use a little bit of this glitter from my um, scrap box. So there is my ice cream truck. It does open at the back. I've got a little velcro dot there. Lots of room for gifting any goodies that you may wish to send. And I think this is super, super fabulous. So here is my um, ice cream truck for my 3D catch up for April. Okay guys, take care. Thanks for watching. See you soon. Bye.